Cities and towns across Missouri have a shortage of police officers. Our Missouri Chief Capitol Bureau reporter Emily Manley was the only reporter in the room today as the governor spoke with law enforcement about what's being done to address safety and the lack of officers. In the wake of recent high-profile shootings across the nation, Governor Mike Parson says to combat crime, judges and prosecutors need to do their job. But he also says that Missouri is better off than a lot of other states in the country. I definitely think we're safe here, here in Missouri, but I also tell you there's risk any time that those, those are out there and that things are going to happen. Bad people do bad things. In a room full of law enforcement officers at the Lake of the Ozarks. <laughs> Missouri's governor saying enough is enough when it comes to violence against police. What you men and women do are the things that the average citizen does not want to do. And they expect you to do it every time, and they expect you to do it right every time. But agencies across the state are dealing with a shortage of officers. The Kansas City Police Department says it's currently short 224 officers. Over in St. Louis City, 123 officers. In Springfield, nearly 50 officers. And in Joplin, 21 officers. You know, we've got our troubles in our state, in parts of it, but you take a look at like a Chicago, who in the world would want to be a police officer? Parson says more resources need to be spent on things like mental health, not more gun laws. If you look where mass shootings occur, the vast majority of them across the United States, or where the violent crime is, they're mostly the urban areas that have some of the strictest gun laws. Saying judges and prosecutors need to be part of the solution. And these police officers out there risking their lives every day, and these victims out here that deserve justice, and all of a sudden you have a system that don't fulfill what its oath is, is problematic for the entire system. Specifically calling out St. Louis Circuit Attorney Kim Gardner. Everybody in the state of Missouri knows that that prosecutor's office does not work efficiently. Gardner's office did respond to Parson's comments by blasting the state's lax gun laws, saying his failure to take responsibility and his finger pointing is disappointing. She welcomes a one-on-one -on -one with the governor to work together to prevent violent crime. Reporting from Missouri Capitol Bureau, I'm Emily Manley.